so that I'll give you the money and I'll rush for the appointment now because I'm almost late. 10,000 candy. Oh. 10,000? Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Oh, let's see. Well, I think this will be okay. Thanks. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. So, <laughs> I love you. Same well, I'll see you tomorrow in the office. Okay. Hold it, Tony. Sandra. I don't make a move, or else I'll break up with you. Sandra. Sandra, wait. What are you doing here? What I'm doing here? You ask 
ask me what I'm doing here. Sandra, I, I, I thought you, you were supposed to be in the village. Supposed to be in the village. Good talk then and good gazing. So it's true that you're going out with my boyfriend. Let, Let me explain me. this. This is not what you think. What? What is it to explain? I I've seen everything. You've explained everything. I told to kiss him and I saw you giving her money. Sandra. You're even ashamed to kiss her in an open place like this. This is not what you're you a disgrace. I, I hate to tell you. You're no, a disgrace. I, I just... And I saw your boyfriend, Sasha. I promise you that I'm going to do it. Let me explain this to you. I just saw him the way and I decided to give her a ride. Sandra! 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 Explain what? Sandra! What is wrong with you? Explain what? Sandra! Driver! Driver! Stop! Sandra! 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 in this mess. Why? What did I do? Now? What did you not do? Sandra!
Uh -huh, Tochi, what is it you said you needed to talk to me about? <sighs> Linda, what I have to say to you is very important. Okay, I'm all ears. Linda, you know you're like a sister to me. I mean, I'm talking about right from our JS1 days through to our university. And yet, we've still managed to remain good friends. In fact, best friends. That's not very easy. You know that, right? Yeah, I know. So, I feel that all I have to tell you is the truth at all times. This your fighting with girls over their fiancés is very, very wrong. I mean, it just has to stop. The other day, it was you and Philomena. She actually tore off your weave on from your hair. Then it was Sandra. She tore your clothes in public. Then Abigail was actually chasing you down the road with her shoe. I mean, come on, girl. This has to stop. Or don't you think so? Are you done? Yes, I'm done. <laughs> well, thank you for your beautiful sermon, Prophetess Tucci. Sandra did what she did and got away with it simply because I, I consider myself so respectable. I didn't have to embarrass myself in the public. <laughs> Else, she would have gotten the beating of her life. Trust me. What did you say? You heard me. Respectable? What's so respectable about getting your clothes torn on the road? <laughs> Touchy, so long as the girl's knees are not tattooed on the guy's manhood, they don't own them. Eh? Yes, let's face it. Have you ever seen a man that owns a woman? Or maybe a woman that owns a man all to herself? Hell no. I mean, after all, I'm always on my own. They come chasing, begging for my love. What am I supposed to do? Run? Oh, please go. Please. You are even crazier than I thought. So what are you saying? That you can't stop this? Is that what you're telling me? Tochi, is it my fault that girls of these days cannot give their men the kind of love and care they want? Or is it the guy's fault that they choose to come to me to seek for that kind of love and care they want? Or is it now my fault that I choose to give to the man that particular kind of love they want? Tochi, Please, if you're done with your sermon this night, can I please go to bed? Because I have to be in the office first thing tomorrow morning. Night, night. Oh. <clears throat> Linda, um, if anything happens to you, you can never say that to you. Well, um, we all know. On the outside, I could beat you. Anyway. Same person, we're no one here for house, we're here for house.
Let me. Hello? Hi, uh, pardon my rudeness. My name is Frank. You are? I'm Linda. I'm Tochi. I, I don't talk to strangers. I'm sorry, so. I'm sorry, uh, don't misconstrue my intentions here. Uh, my spirit told me that you're a very responsible girl, and uh, just let me get to know, know you. Me? Yes. What for? Yeah, I... Um, here's my card. Uh, can I get yours? Well, thank you for the compliment, but I'm sorry, like I said, I don't talk to strangers. Linda, can we go? Oh, I'm out of here. Sorry. All right. Have a nice day. Please, is she your friend or sister? My friend. I. I kind of like. Just. Yes, my card. Can you I get what? your. You know what? To cut the long story short. Here's my car, okay? You can call me so we talk. Have a nice day. You too. Friendship. Marriage is what I'm looking for. I want to marry her. Frank, you already said it a million times. She's okay. She's my friend and I know her best to handle her, okay? Alright, please. I'm, I'm counting worry. on you. Don't worry. I'm counting on you. <laughs> don't worry. Come on. Don't worry. Okay. Thank you for dropping me right. off. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, just a moment. Just a moment. Just take this. No, no, just, just buy yourself anything. Please. Just look and just do your best. Look, how do I know the situation of things? Uh, I'll give you a call. You promise? Don't worry, I promise. I'll call you. I'm counting on you. Hey, relax, okay? Uh, I wish you know how I'm feeling inside. Don't worry, and uh, thanks for this. Take All right, have a nice evening. All right, take care. I don't like the way you're treating this guy, Frank. Seriously, he said he wants to marry you. He's not in for this boyfriend-girlfriend stuff. Besides, he seems a nice guy to me. <laughs> um, that reminds me. He... <clears throat> he gave me this to give to you. Oh. So he thinks he can bribe me with money, right? Please take that money back to him and tell him I am not interested. What? You heard me. What has come over you, Torchy? No, no. I don't seem to understand you anymore. This is not the Torchy I used to. Uh -uh. Something is wrong somewhere. Linda, I'm surprised at you. You out of all people should know what I've been through these past years. I need at least six months to get myself back together. Accepting any man's proposal of, of what boyfriend and girlfriend or whatever. Please. I still remember that. But don't forget, you are not getting any younger. Why don't you marry him yourself? Eh? Or don't you want to be somebody else's wife? It is you he wants. Yeah, right. 
Okay, so what am I supposed to tell him then? I'm sure you heard me. Okay, old Bogoy, seriously, give this a thought, okay? Okay. Are you happy now? 40% happy. Seriously, <laughs> seriously. Please. I'm so hungry. What do you have in your kitchen? Okay, you know, just take it. left when you get the you right. And cook some food. <laughs> <laughs> you come my house, stop. This is okay. <laughs> and bring something for me to eat as well. <laughs> So I decided to come and say hello. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. So tell me, how's your friend? Oh, Tochi, she's fine. She's fine. So, have you convinced her? Hey, slow down, okay? Well, not quite, but we'll get somewhere soon. Trust me. If you do that for me, I already appreciate that. <laughs> slow down, okay? <laughs> Um, Frank, yeah. I've been meaning to ask you something. <sighs> Must it be Tochi? How do you mean? I mean, you know, can't you make another choice? Maybe someone else or something? For now, no. Oh. Okay, if you insist, then I'll keep trying. <laughs> yes, yes. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Thanks. Uh, can I pass the night here? I'm sure you have a guest room. Yes, I do. Um, why? I'm sorry. Actually, there's this coffee at my place and it kicks off by 10 p.m. You know, I thought I could make it here and back to the house before 10 p.m. And it's 10.30 now. And there's practically nothing I can do. I'm sorry for the inconveniences, please. No, 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 no not at all, not at all. Um, um, I have um, three guest rooms, so it's okay. Thank you, sir. All right. Thank you. Thank you. I promise to be out of here. No, come on. Look, look, look. What are friends for? Make a left hand. Okay. Yeah. Welcome. This is the guest room. Just feel at home. All alone in this big room? Well, it's all yours for the night. Oh. Are you scared? Uh, uh, no, uh, I'll manage. I'll. I'll manage. Good. Uh, do you want anything to eat? Uh, I can get you anything. Mm, I already ate at home before I left the house. Uh, except you want me to go prepare something for you to eat? Oh, no, no, not at all. I ate out already. Oh, all men do, especially bachelors. <laughs> yes, yes, and that's why I need Dochi in my life so that I can stop this bachelor thing. Mm, that mm. is it. Well, um. If there's nothing else, I'd like to say good night, okay? Epic? That's what friends are for. I don't need friends anymore. What's going on? Uh, 
Nothing really. I came to ask if you have um, any mosquito coil. Mosquito coil? There are mosquito nests all over the place. There are no mosquitoes in here. I mean, uh, in my house. Did you see a mosquito in your, in your room? Uh, not really. I just uh, wanted to keep it just in case, yeah. Well, there's, I don't have any. Okay, well, you have yourself a nice night, okay? Alright, nice, sweetie. Yeah. That's what friends are for. You don't need friends anymore. Frank? Yeah, what is it? Sorry to bother you again. You wouldn't by any means have a um, soft uh, and alluring ladies not body spray. You know, the type that lures you to sleep and evokes dreams and fantasies. I don't have. I really, I really need to sleep deep. That's why I, I need it, you know. Mm -hmm. Oh, poor me, God. I really needed it. Honestly, I, I need to sleep deep this night. All right, I'll manage. Good night. Good night. stuff just anything just I can't sleep please please I understand your plight okay especially sleeping in a strange room for the very first time but the problem is I have a very early morning appointment tomorrow okay so I can't be of help to you you go back to your room and try and get some sleep you sleep Give me some time, okay? I'm really tired, okay? Okay. Alright. Good night, then. Good night.
Which, which, which can we, which can we get man be discord? Eh? I don't go ask for mosquito call. You know answer me. You know if you look me, Papa. Okay, I come go ask for body spray. He say you no know, get, you no know, look me, you no know, if you won't see me at all, at all. Okay, I still plan for a minute again. Say make I go tell and say I no feel sleep. I won't talk. Talk, you no know, great talk. Say they go, 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 go. Which kind of fits in the morning? Which kind of human being? Which kind of God? Which kind of human being? You know if you get small human sympathy like this. Just knock my job front and back. My sleep job tomorrow, my they go my house. Which kind of human being? Thanks. I love your tie. It's beautiful. Thank you. Um, no, 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 it's okay. Have you been waiting for long? Mm, just about five, ten minutes. All right. I uh, hope you slept well. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You look refreshed. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um, I must rush out now. I have an appointment to catch. I hope I'm not the reason why you're leaving the house so early. No. Mm, not at all. Uh, look, I'll give you some money for taxi. I'm pretty in a hurry. You just gotta catch yourself transport, okay? Thank you so much. All right. Um, hope Tochi will keep that appointment. I already told you, leave that to me, okay? <laughs> I know I can trust you. <laughs> okay, there you go. Frank? Yes? One minute. Yeah. Uh, um, you know, uh, normally, I love my men. Sorry, I forgot you're not my man, but this is better. Oh, yeah, thank you. So have a lovely day. All right, you too. Mm -hmm. I'll see you out. Okay. Oh no, this is meant to be a surprise. Come on in. All right. Surprise 
Sorry, budging in on you like this. You should be. <laughs> like I told your friend, I am for real. Yeah, right. Tucci, why don't you accept him? He's a nice guy, okay? Linda, I can't accept him. Why? I'm not ready for any man's stress. Please. Where are you going? Uh, where are you going? I've lost my appetite. Thank you very much. Tochi! Tochi, you're losing it! You're the one who's losing it. It's okay, right? Okay? Don't worry. Something wrong with her? She's fine. It's just a girl's thing, okay? You sure? Yeah, I don't worry. <laughs> so you want to eat something? No, no, no. I, I ate already. Or maybe you want to finish your girl's food. <laughs> <laughs> find a good and responsible girl to marry. Just tell me, so that I can find one for you. <laughs> I know, Mama, in today's world, okay, civilized men find their wives. That doesn't mean that your mommy is not civilized. Oh, come on, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> oh. When am I expecting to see her? Oh, soon, soon, Mama, soon. Okay. So, yeah. I remember to tell Uncle Kadike that I'll see him uh, in a few weeks' time. Okay. All right, that's for that right. discussion. Okay, okay, that's all right. Frank, please drive with Kim. Of course, you know me. I wish you joined me. Okay, Mama. Mm. That's my son. <laughs> all right, Mama. Okay. All right? Okay. Take care. I will be expecting your call. Yes, yes, I'm going. What are you doing with this slot? 
Don't you dare insult me again. Okay. Uh, don't worry, I, I can explain. <coughs> really? Yeah, yeah. She and I, how me, we are rehearsing, you know? Hi. Rehearsing. Really? Aren't you ashamed of yourself? A girl introduced to you as my friend, you have the guts to speak with her? Now, mother, stop that! I mean, stop that nonsense! Don't you have brain? Can't you stop to reason? You just turned in here, ranting and raving, and I explained. Mm. You don't want to take my explanations. Now, let me tell you, you should have stopped to ask me the first time who this girl is. And I'm going to tell you, this girl here is my artist. My own very artist. Yes. She helps me to make money, the same money that I give to you and dress you up and feed you with. Yes, and you're here embarrassing her. It's not going to happen. You owe me an apology right here and now in front of her. Yes. Yes! Apology! You have to apologize. I apologize to you! It's over, you know me now. Apologize. Another one? Oh, not again. And who's the girl this time? Tamara. She met me at John's place. Amara? Mm -hmm. But weren't you the one that told me that they were dating? What were you doing there? John told me he was done with Amara. He invited me over, so I, I went visiting. And you stupidly believed him? God, you see why I've told you I don't want to have anything to do with any of these men? Look at you. You were the one telling me that I should date Frank. How do you think I would feel if I went to Frank's house and I saw another woman there? How? Touch it, please. Honestly, eh? what I need now is a dab and not a son, okay? Please. So if you can just help me dab my face, thank you. Of course I will help you really have to be careful. These girls will destroy you one day. They will kill you. Chochi! Easy now. This thing hurts. Well, I wouldn't know. You know it's not on my face. Yeah. Uh, so beautiful. You don't deserve all this. Oh.
to make you happy. And to prove that, I just bought this car for you. I have the keys, particulars. Wow! Girl, this is... Wow! I told you. I told you Frank is a nice guy and he's willing to do just anything to put a smile on this face. That's true. You mean you're going to be cruising in this car? Oh, God. <laughs> well, um, that's very thoughtful of you, but um, I'm sorry I can't accept it. What? What? Tochi, are you out of your senses? If you don't accept this car from Frank, you cease to be my friend from this night. Mm. And I mean it. Tochi, why are you why are you rejecting my gift? Look, Frank. I know many girls would die for such an opportunity, but I'm sorry, it just doesn't faze me. I can't accept it. Excuse me. Tochi! Can't accept a gift or reject sending. What wrong she's on that? Slow down, okay? I'll go talk some sense into her, okay? Please do. Tochi! Asking me, you didn't know what you did. Why did you reject that gift outside? A brand new car for that matter, Tochi. Is it not up to me to accept or reject a gift anymore? Eh? Linda, please, I'm using God to beg you. Leave me alone. You're so heartless. You are so mean, Tochi. Why? For how long have you been stressing this guy simply because he wants to marry you? Are you not a woman? Will you get married in this life? I think it's about time I quit discussing this issue. Good. My ears are full already. You're still here. Oh, God. Yes, my dear. I am not going anywhere until you tell me what I want to hear. For God's sake. There are so many women out there that are dying for a husband. I don't want them. I don't want I don't want any of them. Look, I've got lots of beautiful girlfriends. I can give you anyone. Just pick anyone you want. You have told I don't want your friends. I want you. Listen, I've never felt like this for anyone before. Look, let me tell you this. Women throw themselves at me, I'm sure they do. but I don't want any of them. It's you that I want because you are real. You think I'm joking? Look, if you're ready, I tell Banco right now. Hmm? Are you done? I... Look, I'm gonna call the area security. I'm not joking with you. I'll call them. I don't mind, baby. Okay, fine. Just you stay there. The... Baby, it's not a crime loving you. Okay? I'll call them. Look, I don't mind. I don't mind going to prison for you. Okay? Hello? Yes, is this area security? Yes, please. There's a man that's been harassing my life all day. Yes, come to number seven, Balogun Street. Please come now. All right, thank you. Just wait there, they're coming for you. Baby, I'm in love with you. I don't know how else to put it. I want to marry you. Listen, if you, if you accept my proposal, listen, we just go right now. Ajebanku, huh? Look, I am so a man of action. When I say I deliver, listen, honey, I look, look. I'm giving you a chance here, eh? last chance to leave this place. I, Just go quietly. I don't know. Look, probably I'm not saying it the language you understand. Okay? Look, I'm from Linginanya. What do you know about love? Tochi. Huh? Where are these people? If I na some so, eh? In a bumu, that is in a chumola. Mara, I'm asking if I'm here. That is, I'm going, I'm going. Look, look, I'm going. If I'm not going through, kita yarama. 
Where but, are these people? You're still talking. You're baby, still here. I want you. I'm sorry I'm behaving like 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 a fool, but look, that's how love goes, baby, because I am for real. Don't you you're the woman for you're the woman for Frank. Frank, I am not a This is the last time I warn you. Leave this place. Oh! Hallelujah. What is your problem? Officer, this is the man that has been harassing me. Please take him away. Officers, is it a crime to love someone? No. Please join in telling my queen that I love her. I want to marry her. Why are you harassing her? Why are you saying I'm harassing her? Look, haven't you ever fallen in love before? Ah! So you are insulting me! Officer, I am not. Ah! Look. Please! Leave the compound. Cobra! Sir, help me take her, please. Leave. Leave. Hmm? I love Take you, baby. Please, leave. I love you. And I'm sorry, but I'm uh, uh, Um, officer. Yes. Officer, please. Um, please. Could you just release him? We'll resolve everything ourselves. What? So you want him to be released? I really appreciate you coming. Okay, don't worry. Stop. Go and enjoy your woman. Yeah, man. You better stop smiling. I'm not smiling with you yet. Wait, let me open the door. Oh, really? Fela, okay. Mandy Bango, Ooh, that kind of stuff. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. 
you want to get a Yeah, yeah, I like I like Vela. Vela, Vela. Vela is the bomb. Here's the bomb. Vela is legendary. I worship him. Yeah. Who is it? This is nice though. Yeah. Which artist is this? This one is called Osadebe. Osadebe. That is the Akafe, one of high life in Nigeria. Really? What about Rex Loss? Oh yeah, like Rex Lawson is legendary. You know, the guy is, is good. I love, yeah. I, I love uh, Rex Lawson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. But this is Sanibel Sanibel. Just I don't know. It's just cool. I love Rex Lawson so much. Are you ready for your ice cream? Yes. You guys know better. We sure do. Oh, okay. <laughs> come on, come on. Come on. Come on. I hope you're gonna spend the night here. No, I didn't prepare for that. No. Well, you've never spent the night here. What difference does it make if I spend the night? Well, at least we can get to know each other better. So we tell have you some bedtime stories. <laughs> so yeah. I have to spend the night with you to know you better. Mm, not in that so. sense, baby. Yeah. I know. Just, just get a. You know, oh. you know, you know, when, when you spend a night together, it gives you a feel of what the future is going to be like. Oh, you want to get a feel. Not that kind of feel. Come on. <laughs> it's not that kind of feel, baby. Uh -huh. look, 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 look. If I stay, there has to be a big demarcation between me and you. Trust me, I'll win cement blocks. Good. And then when I'm changing, you turn me like I didn't. 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 I it's a promise. Mode of honor. True love goes true. In that case, you may not. Ah! Ah! Come on, come on. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Okay, let's do yes, it. yes, yes, yes. Okay, so uh, is the water on? Yeah, yeah, the water is over there. Now let me. What? Oh, wait. Ow. Oh, let me cut this. Let me put that. All right. I know. Yeah, I'm just trying to make it. Yeah. 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 That's what love is all about. Oh my god. And then funny enough, I don't know how to cook. Someone who really loves me. 
always wondered, you know, you're being edgy about relationships. If there's a story behind it, you know, some, some makes me feel like, like it's not normal. Is there a story? You bet there's a story. In fact, stories. I don't know. I just had lots of bad experiences with guys and it just put me in a negative frame of mind where relationships were concerned, you know? I mean, I don't even know where to start from, man. Just, just any, anywhere we do. <laughs> you really want to hear? Yeah, so you're gonna make me know you better. Okay. Oh, God. Well, there was this guy. He was so sweet and charming and wonderful. And then, I don't know, it just... What is it? What is it? Why can't you just leave me alone for once? What? It's really you. I've been looking for you for the past one month. Where have you been? What sort of question is that? Anyway, why are you looking for me? Ah, I suppose to ask that because you're my boyfriend. Uh, me? Boyfriend. Your boyfriend? Okay. Anyway, that was during our secondary school days. We are, now we are talking about university level. Uh -uh. I don't understand you any longer. I don't understand you. Okay. Let me explain. Why don't you just say this way that we've all gotten an admission into the university? I mean, the level has changed. Distance is much. New station, new life. You go back to your school, get yourself a new boyfriend. Well, I get myself a new girlfriend in my school. But you know why? I, I can't do such a thing now. You now know why I can't do it? Now you listen to me. Listen and listen very well. I've already gotten myself a new girl in my campus. Wow. Good day. Let's go. Chena, please. Chena, please, you can't stop. Please, 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 no, please, it's me. Oh, my God. Uche, please. Oh, my Oh, God. relationship have you? What are you talking about? Have you given me one day of peace in this relationship? We call it Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Are you Thursdays, giving Fridays? counts now? Of what? course I'm counting! I'm counting! What else am I supposed to do? I'm counting it! Come on, you... Ken. Every relationship has its problems. I mean, come on. Problems. Of course! Is that what we call it all the time? The other day, I said, don't go see your mom. And you went to see your mom. Of course I'll go and see her. She was ill. I said, stop wearing this thing. Stop wearing this thing to school. I don't want those guys looking at you, but you what? You make me talk all the time. And you know I'm also patient. I'm not supposed to be stressed. I'm not supposed to be stressed. I'm sorry. You're sorry? You're sorry I'm dying. I don't believe this. So I'm happy. Don't I'm happy. I'm happy. Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Wait, wait. I'm happy. 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 I'm happ
I've had it. Just go. Ken, please, don't do this. Don't do what this. What else am I supposed to do? I'm dying, okay? Please, What? Ken, just leave. You're asking me to leave. Why? Could you just leave me, okay? Listen, I don't want to die young. I don't want to die now. The stress is too much for me. I don't want to die. I'm too young for that. But Ken, I love you. Why are you doing this to me? Please, so don't end it. I love you too, okay? I love you. I you know it. Is that how it looks like? Ken, I will look after you. I will do anything you want. I'm sorry, but please, don't end it like this. Could you please just leave? Just go away. Just go. You're taking these things too far. How? You know Ijoma is about to take her final exam. Yes. All you need to do is just give her that little money. Official car! Oh my, oh my god! This is wonderful! <laughs> my daughter, I am proud of you! Thank you, Papa. Keep it up! Is that the letter? You must do that immediately. All right, eh? Let me give it to you. Please, please. For real. Hey! <laughs> Bye! That's good. You see? You see? Not presenting a long list of what I can't understand. Instead, you'll be happy you are now complaining. No. house with this pregnancy. I've told you if you think we can tie me down with this pregnancy, it is impossible. I told you for the past five months that what we had that initial was a fling. What? A fling? Is that what you say now? If the first one was a fling, what about the second time? The third time, etc. Mike, let me tell you something. If you think I'll have this baby out of wedlock, you better have a rethink. For God's sake, I told you I already have a fiance. I don't care! I don't care. This pregnancy is your responsibility. You better take care of it. Hi, Mike. Such good news. Who is this, Mike? Who is this? Tell her. Who is this, Mike? Explain what? Young lady, as you can see, I'm carrying his. What's up? Mike. So, all this time, he's been cheating on me. Mike! Mike and I, I will save each other. Mike. Please. Please. No! <laughs> Oh, 
don't you know what I'm talking It's okay. Hmm? It's okay. My brother is. Hmm? God has a perfect plan for you. Hmm? You don't know why God allowed it to happen in the first place. Hmm? How can I do this to you? As for that useless mic, God will punish you for using my daughter. My dear, stop talking like that. God has his own way of doing things. <laughs> Do you know what would have happened tomorrow if my married our daughter? God doesn't want it like that. <laughs> Touch my daughter. Stop crying. Mike is not the only man in this world. Eh? Your man will come. <laughs> Stop crying. You have to listen to your father's advice, okay? Hmm? It's okay. I know it hurts. Hmm? Just allow, allow it to go. Okay? Hmm? It's alright. <laughs> I swear. Hmm? <laughs> Your garden. Uh, you inside. Make a go call her. No, 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 no. Just, just have me give him this. Take, give him the key. You hear? And don't drive this car because I know you don't know how to drive. She uh, here. Madam, I'm not try. I'm not But make a call again now. I say leave him. Just give him the key. Which key? Okay, now that lady, where they drive uh, oh, oh, oh. Which lady? Madam, now that one, where they drive one blacker. She go back and forget to walk come out. The lady I told you I wanted to marry. In this house again? Uh, yes, take madam, take take In this house again? Mary, what time you Look at it. Where is she? Go 
But so what happened? Oga, Nasa has been here, Jojo. She carried the car, come back here. Carry the key with me. The first time I can come call you, you don't want. Where is the key? That's here. What's that? I get. Open the gate. Okay, okay. okay. Pocket. I took it back to Mike. What? What did you just say? Mama, I said I've taken the car back to Mike. I don't want to see it anymore. Don't you, are you mad? How can you do a thing like that without even telling me your mother? Hey! Papa Tochi! Okay, ma! Okay, ma! Yes? Please come, 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 come! What is it? And why are you shouting? Do you know that Tochi has taken that car back to Mike? Tochi, is it true? Yes, Papa. Why did you do that? Papa, I don't want anything that reminds me of him around me. But you should have told your mother or me before doing that. I want that. Papa, Mama, I'm sorry. It's just, I couldn't just bear it any longer. Please, understand. Well, if you did that to please yourself, no problem. My dear, it's time you forget about that car. Yes. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. It's okay. And then, um, I would like to relocate to Delta, Asaba, to be exact. Um, I want to go with my best friend, Linda. Because her brother said that he will hook us up with some really nice jobs. Who do you know there? Hmm? Mama, I know I don't know anyone, but that's where Linda's brother comes in handy. My daughter, I am not against you relocating. But what I'm saying is that a baby hand is worth more than a million in the bush. Certainly. What about your job in Enugu here? And the private officer can promise you by your company after you are cursing abroad. That is true. Papa, I just want to forget everything about this place. The cars, the men, the job, everything. I need to start a new life. What about with your parents? Mm. You're exceptional. <laughs> but I really need to do this for me. You know? Please. What? So that was what happened and I sort of swore off men after that. I'm sure you can understand. Absolutely. I want to assure you one thing. That as long as I live, you'll never know hurt again till the day I die. You promised? I will never hurt you. Because you mean more than life to me. You're so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> My baby. Oh, my mm. first night of sleeping here. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Oh, we're supposed to have cement blocks. Hey, yes, yes, yes. yes. Cement blocks. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. 
No passage. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. What about the demarcation? You threw it away now. Oh, this is my hair. This gets everywhere. Two okay. Yes, uh, manager, come to my office. Okay, sir. Come on, already, sir. Yes, sir. Why are these companies still own us? I'm talking about Talview, Bukana, PCC and Sons. Sir, Bukana was here two days ago and they brought a check of 8.5 million, promising to pay the balance of 3 million now by next week. And BCC also brought a check of 13.2 million. And tell you, 
Just phone me. Tell me to be expecting them tomorrow before 10 a.m. Mm. Well, that's good, that's good. Have you paid any checks? Yes, I paid it. Okay, man. Good. Now, make sure you call um, people at Telview before they end up work to remind them to bring that check tomorrow. Okay, sir. Please don't fail. Okay, sir. Good. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Um, sir, I want to remind you about our stock. It's going down. We have only three containers. And BCC say they are coming in three days time to buy you. All right, um, tell the stuff when you need to come. Okay, sir. Oh, manager, how are you? I'm fine. How's it work? I'm fine. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hope you're not stressing yourself too much. Well, I like to stress for you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we went shopping and we kind of ran out of money. So we were wondering if you could like prep us up a little bit, please. Okay, okay all right. That's not a problem. Like how much? Um, 10, 20,000 is okay. All right, great. Yeah, I've still got some household stuff to buy. All right, okay. Well, my wife. You never like anything. <laughs> I'll check it down. So sweet. Look at him. Thank you, darling. All right. All right, let me leave you to it. Huh? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, please. <laughs> Jealousy. Exactly. Okay, honey. Bye. Bye. Bye.
Oh, thanks, Doctor. Uh, yes, that is the good news. But uh, unfortunately, we also found traces of malaria and typhoid in our system. And you know she's hypertensive. We have to really monitor her to take care of her properly. Wow. Uh, typhoid, malaria, yes. hypertension. Wouldn't all this affect the pregnancy? No, no, no. That is why I instructed that she be admitted immediately. We are doing all we can to put everything in check. Okay, doctor. Thank you so much. Please do everything humanly possible to, there is no problem. to make sure she becomes. I mean, she's all right. There's no problem. We care. God heals. God is in control. All right. I'll see you later. How did all this start? My dear, I just woke up this morning and before I knew what was happening, I found myself here. Just like that? Just like that. God. And where is Frank? Oh, Frank. <laughs> I told him to go home. He was just running up and down. I didn't want the poor guy to collapse. <laughs> so I told him to go. Hey, Joma and I are here. I'll be fine. You mean Frank is more old? Yes, yes. yes. Hmm. yes. Hmm. Linda, mm. guess what? What? <laughs> Just guess. You're pregnant? <laughs> Two months and three weeks. <laughs> Okay, yeah, something like Dagafil. I wouldn't know actually, okay. yeah. Yeah, I have it. Let me bring this. Okay. How much is a dose? Mm, a dose is um a dose is two hundred naira. Uh, I want just the dose. Okay, no problem.
How are you? I'm okay. Have you been drinking? Anyway, I brought something really nice for you. I'm sure you'll love it. Okay? Yeah. I'm sorry, I'm not hungry. You are hungry. Frank, the fact that Touch is in the hospital doesn't mean you won't leave again. Please. I said I'm not hungry. She's my friend, okay? That's why I'm doing this. If I were to be in her shoes, she would have done the same thing for me, okay? So eat and be strong for her, please. Okay? You love it. Tasty. That tastes good. Oh, nice. Uh, why don't you take no, a spoon no, no, no. and... Mm -mm, this is just for you. I just want you to eat well, okay? I'm gonna say that. Cook really well. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. No, this is... I didn't know what this was. Oh. Oh. Ah, ah. <laughs> hey, hey. Hey, hey. The boy feels soft. Yeah. I soft. know. My wife's night gown. Oh, come on, Frank. There's no cause for our money, okay? Don't touch me. As a matter of fact, you just gave me the most blissful night I've ever had in my entire life. What are you saying? Thanks to you, honey. Stop that! up here.
too. In this minute. Go and get out of my wife's nightgown and leave my house right now before I do something. Leave my house! Okay, where? okay. Oh, why did this happen? Oh my god. Look, how did you get here? How did you get in here? What kind of person is that? What? He joined the movie. Wow, why did you what? What did you say? Oh, Thank you so much for everything. It's alright, it's alright. Thank you so much, it's alright. Don't forget to give me a call. I'm trying to notice what you're Um, I don't want to call you. She's going to be alright. Amen. I say amen to that. Yeah. It is well. Thank you so much. Take good care of her, eh? Of course I will. Yeah. It's the only one I got. Bye bye. It's alright. It's well. Take care. Oh, wow. I can't wait. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. When I'm in love, I give my heart, I give my body and soul. But all the time, I sacrifice my lovers to see. Frank? Yeah, how are you? I'm good. Yeah, so what do I... Nothing. I. Mm. I just had this funny dream. I, I wanted to share, but don't don't worry. Just go to sleep now, okay? Are you sure. Yeah, baby. But unfortunately, we also found traces of malaria and typhoid in our system. And you know she's hypertensive. to do about this pregnancy. What else? You marry me. Marry you? Mm -hmm. 
course you know that's not possible. What will people say? It's not possible. I can't marry two wives, okay? Okay, listen, there's, there's really no need for all this spacing, okay? Come sit down, let's talk. Alright? Good. Alright, so tell me, now that you want us to talk, I just want to have what do we do about this? It's hey, not a laughing matter. Easy. Slow down. No, please. Uh, look, look, look. Slow down. Linda. Okay, okay. Frank, it's unfortunate, okay? You're destined to marry two wives. Look, stop this now. Look, what's wrong with you now? I've told you, stop this. Uh, you remember my first night in your house? Wow. That day, you made me have sleepless nights. Remember? I came to your room asking for a mosquito coil. You turned me down. I came back again asking for a uh, body spray. You turned me down. I had to come back again begging you to talk to me that I, I couldn't sleep all to get your attention but you shunned me well thank God destiny here we are you're going to marry me and my friend will you stop this nonsense stop this nonsense okay. look why, why were you doing this to me why <laughs> what am I doing I'm only fighting for what is going to bring joy into my life. Oh, okay, okay. I know what your problem is, don't you, right? And uh, maybe what people will say. Fine, you have other options, don't you? What are you saying? You own a house in America. Do the necessary things and fly me out of this country. Linda. What do you want from me? Money? Or this blackmail? What I want. Okay. I want you. I've told you to stop this! I've told you to stop this! I, you can't want me! I can't marry you. I can't marry two wives. You won't marry me? I won't marry you. Listen, honey. If you don't marry me, I'll be first to tell Tochi. You will do no such thing. Dear me. Love says goodbye. I just don't know why love makes me cry. I try and try, but still I find my heart always breaks all the time. Oh, when, when what do I do? How do I cope with this? How did this happen? If I tell my wife, will she understand? Will she forgive? If I don't tell her, then how long will I continue to live like this? Do I accept Linda's conditions? Fly her abroad? Live a false and double life? Oh my God. No, I must tell Tochi. I must let her know. What can I? Oh my God. I'm so confused. I must tell Tochi. No. You can't tell her. No, you must tell her. I can't tell her. Oh my God. Oh my God. You can't tell her!
like one and two. We look out for each other in everything we do. I can't believe that you would turn your back. said and I've come to a conclusion I will fly you to America because of my wife because I love her very much I don't want to hurt your feelings but on one condition um, you will have to sign an undertaking for me. Promising not to come back to this country. Okay. If that's the way you want to play it, I'm game. Good. Tomorrow we'll go to the embassy, American embassy, to get your visa. After which we'll go to your village. After which we'll travel out of the country. Baby, baby, you are so mm, sweet. Mm. Thank you, thank you. I'll see you tomorrow. Always together, like one and two. Look out for each other. In everything we do, I can't believe that you would turn your back on me. Break my heart, take my man, destroy my family. You are glowing. What's the secret? Tell me. <clears throat> well, let's say the good luck has done it. Meaning? <laughs> Meaning this girl here is traveling to America next week. What? <laughs> Just like that? Just like that? Hey! <laughs> How come now? How come? Um. Well, that's this new catch, you know. Yeah. Hmm, I trust you. you know, <laughs> new catch, um, I told him my only problem is to travel abroad, mm -hmm. and he started working on one or two things. But as I am talking to you now, my papers are ready. <laughs> that is good. That is good. I'm so happy for you. <laughs> Thank you. But is he ready for marriage? Mm. Well, you know these guys. I wouldn't know for now, mm. but. That guy, girl, he is 
is rich. Do you know he even owns a house in America? Really? Yes. Hey! <laughs> Linda, I'm so happy for you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, John, please go and get me a bottle of red wine. This calls for a celebration. Yeah. Celebration, serious what? one. Hmm. <laughs> it's not every day. So just me now. Let's see like what does he look like? Okay, okay, okay. He's tall. Okay. You like like no! <laughs> you know that. And the most important thing is that his pocket stays with dollars. <laughs> but my only problem is this one. I just hope and pray. He loves me as much as your husband loves you. Uh, my sister. It is your portion. Amen. It is your portion in Jesus' name. You're my point of contact in prayer. I receive it. You need it. He will love me. He will. Amen. He <laughs> <laughs> Hey, my sister. I can't wait to. Serious. <laughs> I'm saying I'll go and visit you now. Yeah, you just well, well. When you keep bed, when you sleep to bed, to me, drop. Okay, and, and the baby is a bit strong. It's for horse. It's coming to my house. That's okay. standard now. I agree. Go so without so. saying. Okay. I'm only do. You not be saying that this better now. For just do one break dance here now. <laughs> That's one thing. Hey, hey. hey. <laughs> my sister. Let me pour you some juice. Wow, international call. Hello. Hello, Linda. Oh my god, how are you, darling? How is life in the US? Oh, fantastic. What? You're getting married next week? <laughs> is it that same guy you were telling me about? Oh, I am so happy for you, darling. Congratulations. <laughs> oh, you know I can't make it now with my condition, yes. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll talk to my husband. All right, my dear. Congratulations. I wish you happy married life, okay? All right, darling. Bye. <sighs> darling, can you imagine that? Linda is getting married in America next week. Really? Yes. Wow. <laughs> um, I'm happy for her. Oh, wow. Darling, could you please do me a favor? What? You know, by right, we both should be at that wedding. I mean, Linda was my chief bridesmaid for my wedding, you know, and I don't want it to be like... And I know you're traveling next week. Why don't you just breeze through there and witness the wedding? Please. Um, okay. Um, I'll be there if, if that will make you happy. For real? Oh, thank you. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. Always uh, together. Like one and two. Mama, what is the problem? Ever since I came from the city, you've been acting very strangely. If you're not happy that I'm here, then I will go back. I don't understand. Touch my daughter. Don't say like that. See you drive all the way from the city to see me. I'm happy. And you're highly welcome, my dear. Mama? Hey, Mama, if you're happy, what is the problem? Touch, you won't understand. By the way, where did you say your husband, Frank, traveled to? Frank? Yes. He went to the US for Linda's wedding, and then from there he would travel to Japan to import his goods as he usually does. Did you say Linda's wedding? Yes, Mama. Mm. Mama, did uh, Frank offend you? Thank you. 
Frank is fine. He traveled. Yeah, the kids are fine. Oh, I'm so happy for you. Eh? Okay. All right. <laughs> All right, bye. <sighs> oh, Linda. Hmm? I hope one of these days I'll be able to see this her husband anyway. Come on, come on, 
Gentlemen, <coughs> I'm Inspector John Dada. Yeah. Madam, please, are you Mr. Frank's wife? Yes, I am. Where is your husband? He traveled, but I'm expecting him back this evening. Well, madam, I'm afraid there is a problem. What? What problem? Your husband was coming back from the airport this morning. Yes. Where some animals are back from? What? My husband? How did you just... Madam! 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 What happened? Madam, 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 I'm not lacking anything. Where is my husband? Is that not lack? <laughs> if I may ask you, what of those robbers that they dismiss? Well, the time the incident happened was exactly the time we were passing, and we saw them. They wanted to run, but unfortunately for them, we shot them Good. and recovered about uh, twelve thousand dollars, which I believe. This night from uh, Mr. Frank. Oh, that's a very good job. If all the police in this country can work this way, very soon all these robbers will be fished out and will be made to face their judgment. Exactly, exactly. Uh, madam, Madam, please, I'm sorry for what happened. Eh? Please, if you feel better, just come to the station and collect the money. I'm sorry, eh? Thank you.
Say you come. Say you come. Okay. All right, darling. Thank you. God bless you. You are a really good friend to me. God bless you. All right, darling. Bye. She said she will make it. She did? Yes. Of course. She's a good friend. Yes. Let me call Clara. Hello. Hello. I'm going to get you my job. Oh, they're fine. They're asleep. Oh, yeah, God they've God. had a bit, a bit of a rough time. You know how it is I now. Know, I know. Anyways, is your luggage? Yes. Okay. Right. You know what? First mm. things first. Let me call Mama. Mama! Mama! Mama, Mama come! Oh, Linda is here! <laughs> <laughs> you remember Ijoma, of course. Yes! Oh, Ijoma! Go, 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 go! Hi! Okay, I'm not looking bad. Thank you, thank you. Hey, how are you? <laughs> You're so pretty. How are you? Mama, Linda is back from America for my husband's burial. Isn't that sweet? Mama! Maybe because I'm wearing a shusket. Oh, please, <laughs> there's no big deal there now. Ah, you. Anyway, first things first. Mm -hmm. Let me give you the keys mm -hmm. because we've been having lots of sympathizers, and I want you to have your privacy. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. fine, that's fine. So let's go. Uh, Always together, like one and two. We look out for each other in everything. That you would turn your back on me Break my heart, take my man Destroy my family You are my friend The very best friend I have in this world You took my man The only man that I ever loved I'll never do that to you How can you do that? to embarrass my friend Linda. You knew she came all the way from America for Frank's burial. You, you call that serpent? That evil internet, your friend? By the time that girl, you come to know her, you will know the stuff she's made of. You will know that she's the greatest enemy you've ever had in life. Oh. I wish Frank is alive to witness what he has caused. Mama, Frank has caused nothing. Linda and I have been friends even before I married your son. And she was even my chief bridesmaid at my wedding. And you witnessed... Don't you go and rest! 
I say soon, very soon, you will understand what I mean. Go inside. My brothers and our wives, I call this meeting in order to resolve a very important issue so that the planned burial of our brother Frank can go on without hitches. Tochi. Yes, Uncle. Who do you say this lady is? What is she to you? Uncle. Her name is Linda. She's my best friend, and she came all the way from America for my husband's burial. Linda, you heard what she said? What is she to you? She's, um, Tochi. My husband's first wife. <laughs> what? Which husband? Frank. Uh, What's going on here? Our Miss Deputy. We've been looking for a way to resolve this matter ever since everybody returned for France Oh my god. You are a mature woman. And nothing again in this world will be as shocking to you as the death of your husband. So please take this easy, okay? You see, your friend here, Linda, was also your husband's second wife. And she has also returned for this burial. Linda! No, 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 no. No. Frank has killed me. Frank has killed me. Linda, please. Linda, please tell everybody here that it's not true. It's true, Tochi. Frank is my husband. In fact, he was the one that sent me to America. Oh my God. Oh God, I'm dead. I'm finished. Um, Tochi, listen to what happened. Frank, our son. Uncle. The reason why I came back with Zimuza is for you to repeat exactly what you told me and your mother earlier the day. Uh, thank you, Uncle. Well, I... I called you all to tell you that I want to get married again. The woman I want to marry is pregnant for me. So I, I want to get married to her. Uh -uh. See, I don't see anything wrong in it too. If a man like Frank decides to have two wives, as far as he can adequately take care of them. So my son, you can go ahead and have your second wife. <laughs> Thank you. Zimos, is that the fatherly advice you can give to our son, Frank? Oh, I've seen the nonchalant attitude you have for this family. Listen and listen good. If he courage my son to get married to a second wife and anything happens to him, to his abuse you. I will hold you responsible. Uh, I will hold you responsible, this mozo. Look, look at more. This mozo. Huh? I'm highly disappointed in you. Yes. I brought you here to help the sweet friend from taking a second wife. And you're here pushing him to go ahead. Uh, what are you saying? But didn't you hear what he said? That the woman is already carrying his baby. Or do you want him to push her away with his own blood just like that? No, that's not going to happen. Look, Uncle, Mama, I didn't call you people you had to dissuade me. I need your support. Frank, you cannot get support from me. Just don't worry. Let Tochi come back. That will be the first thing I will tell her. No, Mama, you will not do a thing like that. Look, you don't understand the situation. Understand what? Look, you don't know what I'm going through. You don't know what I'm going through. 
Look, Toji is hypertensive. Not just hypertensive, acutely hypertensive. If she gets to know about this, she might die. She might die of heart failure. Look, Mama, I called you all to tell you this because you're my family. This information is not for the public. So please, I want it to remain within us. That's why I'm not doing anything big about this marriage. Like I said, you don't understand why I'm doing what I'm doing. But someday, I will tell you. So please, like I said, I don't want Tochi to know about this. On no condition. Because if you do, Mama, I swear to God, I will stop being your son. Frank! Mama, no, Tochi! Frank! Withdraw your statement! No, Mama, we do it! Mama, look, no, how can I say Do you like want, that? do you want, look, look, is it that you take it, you want to say it? And you have a cops. Do you prefer Tochi to be dead? It's not, it's, 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 please, please, Mama. It's a very... Girl is getting on my nerves. <laughs> Mama, you sent for me. Yes. Linda, the reason why I called you out here is to talk to you like a mother. Thank God Okadike is here to bear me witness. In case anything happens, my son Frank has told us everything on how both of you are planning to get married. Linda, that your evil plan will not work. Yes. Just ask my son to pay you any amount so that you will leave him alone to enjoy his peaceful marriage. Tochi, his wife, is a woman like you. And your friend, for that matter. Don't you have conscience? Where has she wronged you? Where? I don't want to see you here tomorrow morning. Else I will lose my anger on you. Uh, Ijenwa. Ijenwa, it's okay. It hasn't come to that. Um, now, oh, Dr. Linda. You've heard what Frank's mother said. She has spoken to you the way she did because it's, it's your own interest. Think about it. If you were to be in Tochi's shoes and your own friend goes behind you to marry your husband, would you be happy? <coughs> it's not right. It's not. Mm. So make hay while the sun shines. Anyway, um, Mama, Uncle, I've heard what you people said. Um, can I go in and rest because I'm actually fucked out? Hmm? Go in and rest? <laughs> well, that will be your last rest in that house. So you don't have anything to say about this? I said I've heard what you people said. When my husband gets back, we'll talk that over. Husband? Linda! Very handsome young man. Thank you, Papa. <laughs> My daughter, is this friend not the one that wedded some time ago? Eh? And he attended the wedding as she bridesmaid. 
Whose wife thought she's your best friend? Is it not? Mama, does it matter? Does it? No. So long as he's marrying me traditionally and honorably. Nay. Did you hear her? Yes, did you hear your daughter Nay? Yes, I did. What do you say? <clears throat> Linda, my daughter. Papa. Frank is a big man. Is he not? Yes, Papa. Hmm. And he might even buy you a car after getting married to me. Eh? Yes. Go on, my daughter. I will support you fully. My, you. my, how can you say a thing like this now? I am surprised at you. I'm how can you? Oh. And you, Linda, retrieve yourself before it's late. Retrieve yourself, Linda. And you don't bring you up in this world this way. Retrieve yourself, Linda. How can you say such a thing? Don't you love money? Look at me. If you don't go so you cannot have. Don't you love money? Papa, it's okay. It's no, I love money. Oh. But it's not this one. Oh. It is not this one. Oh. Papa is good money. See, Mama. Listen, Mama, it's already too late. Yes, because I am pregnant for Frank and he is flying me to America to live. Hey! Abomination! Linda! You're pregnant for Frank Linda! Hey, Jibe! Mama, I can you shout? Eh? I will shout! I will shout, Linda! Okay, shout. Linda, I will scream! This is abomination! How can you be pregnant for Frank? Your best friend's husband, Linda. How can you? Oh, how can you? And if that introduction comes up, I will not be there. I will be part of it, Linda. Eh? I will not. If you like, don't come out. I will be there. We are grateful to all of you who have come to grace this occasion today. Now, it is our time now for the Diopa uh, to give uh, palm wine to our daughter for her to show us the would-be husband. Linda, my daughter, come. Take this palm wine. Give it to your proposed husband. That's our one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All of you. In the bar, in the room. In the room. I'm so happy today that I am handing the hand of my daughter in marriage to her proposed husband. I tell her very well and she will disappoint you people. In the bar, in the room. In the room. is 
exactly what happened. We did all we can to stop Frank from going into the second marriage. But he insisted. And we had no choice but to let him have his way. Believing that God would take control of everything. Uncle Okadike. Uncle Zimuzo. And even you, Mama, what have I done to deserve this? I told you that this girl you called your friend is not a good friend. But you are doubting me. Now you have seen things yourself. Linda, all this time, I've been protecting you, fighting for you. From all those girls whose boyfriends you snatched. And now you have the guts to marry my own husband. Okay. Don't worry. By the time I'm through with you, you will know the type of person I really am. my position for the peaceful and respectable manner in which I was home Frank and your husband was buried. Having said that, let me quickly add that the mother of this village have warned that neither Tucci nor Linda she cut her hair in the traditional mourning gesture until the problem between the two of you had been resolved. How, how else? How can you mourn your husband who you so much disrespected with your quarrels? Uncle, I want to cut my hair. I have to. I love my husband and I want to mourn him in the full traditional way. Tochi, my daughter. First, we must listen to the Umadas. When this issue is resolved, then you can cut your hair. What about you, Linda? Do you have anything to say? Um, well, the, if the Umadas say we shouldn't cut our hair, then we shouldn't cut our hair. It's okay by me. Well, once again, I thank you all. We shall now disperse to convert the letter over the issues at stake between the two of you. Thank you. Place, eh? It's very, very expensive, so please wash it with this care. One. Mm, that one. Okay. Just take your time. What kind of soap are you using? Hope it's locked. And Madam Tochi, were you the one that packed locked my house? <laughs> okay, let me have the keys. Linda. Linda the betrayer. Yes, I'm the one that locked you house because I'm ready to go back to Lagos so I suggest you get yourself and that little rat of yours and go back to where you guys came from you understand and let me tell you something if you want to go back to Lagos huh? padlock your house take your kids and go back to Lagos and when I am done with money my husband I will padlock my house and take my lovely kid back to the United States of A okay do you see how stupid you are? 
If it was your house to lock, how come I have the keys? That's arrant nonsense. And let me remind you, Tochi, Frank married both of us, okay? He married you traditionally, and you, you wedded in the church. He married me traditionally. And my white wedding was in the United States of America. And that makes my wedding more authentic than yours. And so please, for your own good, do not start a fight you cannot finish. All right? Is that what you're saying? Yes, you're very funny. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Let me kill her! Hey, 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 What is it? What is it? I said, Mama, let me kill her! Do not say. Stop it, Tochi. Stop it. Linda, why did you leave your apartment to come down here to fight her? Eh? Mama, he's this pig. He had the audacity and a fountry to go lock up my house. And when I came asking for the keys, she was busy insulting herself and not me. Husband, hey, 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 hey. insult me. Me what? You're already insulted. You are finished. Look at yourself. Shameless. Touchy. Thing. It's okay, it's okay. Touchy. It's okay, my daughter. It's not done like that. No. I know how you feel. Please give me the key. Give, Mama. Give her the key. Give, give the me key. the keys. Mama. Mama, it is the respect I have for you that's making me give you this key. But better tell this woman. Tell her that she doesn't leave this place. It will be her corpse they'll remove from here. And I'm not joking. Linda, go back to your apartment. Mama, I came for the keys now. Leave the key. Have the key. Take the key and leave. Thank you. Ooh, fool. Play to win, girl. Play to win. 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 I told you not to fight with Linda. That this matter will be settled. Mama, that is thing to leave my sister's house. No. Shut up! Shut up! Why are you telling her to shut up? You will shut up! Why are you telling her to shut up? Are you Linda? Or whatever you call yourself. Next time you touch my sister, I mean next time, I will make sure I break your head. <laughs> go, 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 sir, go. Oh, that was true. Linda, have you seen what you have cost? What have cost? I want you better who didn't listen. Fighting with Toshi will not solve this problem. You have to bend her before her because you betrayed her. I did not betray her. You betrayed her. Why are you judging me like that? I'm saying my house and you get fighting me. Listen well. The next time you fight in this house, I will not show you ever regret coming into this family. Do I make myself clear? Wait, the house is now divided or something. Wait, the house. Open the house. My elders, I greet you all. You're welcome. 
I and my brother Ibezim are here because of the news. My daughter Linda told us concerning her first husband's wife, Tochi, who is dying her of her rights. We are here as peacemakers to settle this matter amicably. After all, both of them were friends before. Now they want to kill themselves over nothing. I mean over nothing. I greet you all. Nine your Foka, I am highly disappointed. I give you the same respect that I would give to my own father. You know very well that Linda and I have been friends since childhood. Up until the time we came to bury my husband. And then I realized that I've only been friends with a devil all these years. You knew very well that I was married to Frank when he came to ask for your daughter's hand. And yet, you agreed to that union, knowing fully well that I was his wife. Well, I am going to make sure that I make Linda regret ever coming into this family. And that is a promise. Hey, hey, hold it there. Hold it. Because I will not sit here and watch that thing insult my father. Keep quiet, you. Uh, keep quiet. Linda. Keep quiet, both of you. Keep quiet. City and watch that. Linda! You are the one that's a thing. You are obviously a dirty thing. Um, our in law, Mazio Foka. Welcome. We've heard what you said. But first of all, I want to ask your daughter a question. Linda. Before you took this matter to your father, did you tell me? Did you tell Frank's mother? Oh. Or any other member of the family for that matter? No. No. Have we the members of this family met first time ever over this issue? No. No. You just felt you could rush to your father with uh, your own side of the story. Anyway, I don't have anything to tell you for now. Um, Mazio Foka, tell us what to do. Well, since their husband, my son in law, is dead, I think the best thing for us to do is to share his property between Tochi and Linda, my daughter, so that my daughter will take her own and go. Hey! Afoka! You called my son's death nothing, and now you are here to share his property. Afoka! You are here to share my son's property! It's okay. Oh my God! It's all right. It's all right. Hey! It's all right. right. Afoka! Uh, Mazi Afoka, we've heard you. Hmm? But let me tell you what you don't know. Our brother Frank died without leaving any way. He left no will behind. So we the members of the family must first of all recognize ourselves before making a statement on the issue. You better hurry up, oh. As they say, delay is dangerous. Ah uh, ah. Uh, no, oh, delay you. Huh? What have you got to delay? What? No. Now, Foka. Oh, We've heard now. Who is delaying? Huh? We what heard. What the fuck? It's all right. No, it's this all is right. Your plan. Uh, all you people care about is feeding on my late husband's properties, right? Okay. I will deal with each and every one of you. You will not do anything. You will not do anything. Ah, uh -uh. after he married me, just the way he married you. You are a shameless woman. Very shameless. I'm the wife. Not, he married, married me legally, legally and not the wife. Is that the issue? I was married in America and my husband is stronger. You are not talking to my own. best friend and look at what your best friend. friend. Look at what you me. What is that? Papa, you can you see that? Can you see that? I was married. You were married. Okay. He paid my price. Snake, you came to the back door. What do you think? God, he paid my white price. Back door. You are. I will always be the first. First, first. First will be the last. Yeah. It's not how far. It's how. It's not how long. It's how far. How far? 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 How far?
are with you now now. Hey, hey, can't you see? Linda, that's all right now. Hey, Linda, it's okay now. You are the thief. You are the thief. But you want to come and lead us. I don't need friends anymore. Ichama, hurry up, please. Why can't you relax your next week? Told you. Are you leaving me here alone? I'm just tired. I am, I told you. Come and see. She's leaving for Lagos. I don't know what she's saying. Linda! Are you insane? That's an obvious question. Her wife. Yes, sir. Where are you going? Uncle, I'm going back to Lagos. Why, why so sudden? That's the way I feel. That's just the way I felt this morning when I woke up. How about the problem between you and Linda? How are we going to settle it if we go back to Lagos now? Uncle, I have no problem with anybody. And as for you, Linda, just don't even try going back to that house in the States. Because when I get back, I'm going to sell that property and nothing will happen. You're just pushing. You're just pushing, let me tell you. Uncle, did you hear her? Wait, 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 wait. Okay. wait. Oh, Mama. Uncle, you put are letting her go, right? You put are letting her go like that without this problem being settled, right? Okay. She's going to do her wish, eh? Listen to me. Okay. Linda, listen. Listen. I want to repeat myself. Make sure you don't try to do anything funny. I've told you this matter will be settled. Settle this matter. Like this. Anything funny. Oh, anything funny. You will hear more than funny. You are my people who hear more than funny. You let her go, eh? You let her go. After it will be Linda, 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 Linda will not rest in this house. Ah, they married her the way they married me. In you, yes, of A. That's what friends are for. I don't need friends. Don't skip your ears to the ground because you're going to hear from me. Ah, this one gave me with this. This guy gave me with this. Linda, Linda, I have started. I have started. Don't you? She's too small. She's too small. She knows me. She knows me now. Afro. She has a whole kid. They married me traditionally and otherwise. You S of A. Are you going to hear from me? Afro, my church is more beautiful than her.
sue me over my husband's property? Linda went ahead and sued you to court. Yes, Uncle. I was here the other day and somebody just walked in here and served me the papers. When is the court sitting? The day after tomorrow. The day after tomorrow? Yes. I think we have to call the lawyers together and discuss with them after the court session. Okay? And after that, we will teach this Linda a little lesson. For disobeying the king's men. Yes. Who is she? Yes, no matter how small an idol is, you must carry it with two hands. Have we now grown so small that Linda disrespects us? Imagine. I hope you have all the documents relating to your late husband's property. Yes, Uncle, I do. By the way, where is she now? Uncle, I don't know. I guess we'll have to wait until the day of court. Hey, mad woman. Please. Uncles, let's not bother ourselves about Linda for now. Enjoy your drinks, and if you want something to eat, I can rustle up something quickly. Ben and DK. Once again, I say welcome. As I said before, my name is uh, Ichie Okadike. And here is my brother Ichie Zimuzo. We heard what happened. And that's why we traveled from the village to see how we can help settle this matter amicably between our wives. Ruchi and Linda. I must say, however, that Linda went to court without the consent of the family. And this hasn't gone down well with us. So we came up from the village to take this matter back and see how far we can settle it and make it between them. And one more thing is this. We'll be fair in handling this matter. And after everything, we'll make sure that our two wives here will have a custom smile. I don't know if you have anything to say, my learned friend. Well, Barrister Ben, I don't know what you have in mind. But you see, it left to me, I think, we should have just handled this matter once and for all at the law courts. But since the elders had to come all the way from the village for this matter, they should be given a, 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 a chance. But only on one condition. My clients, Linda, should not be intimidated in any way. I don't know if I'm so I sound clear. And let me also warn that if by any means my client Tochi feels cheated after this settlement. We will have no other choice but to continue with litigations in court. 
Pucci and Linda. Do you agree? Yes, sir. All right. Thank you very much, Registrars. We'll get back to you. Okay. Well, my people, I welcome you. Thank you. We have two cases before us. One is the case of Linda, who sued her fellow wife to court without informing us. And despite our warning, anyway, she will have to settle that with Umada. We are here today to settle the case between the two of them, Tucci and Linda to settle the problem once and for all. It's unfortunate that our son Frank died without leaving any will. That notwithstanding, we try to do justice. We try to do things in a manner that we consider fair to all. This paper I have in my hand contains a comprehensive list of all the property acquired by Frank before his death. So each year Zimuzo, you will take this and read it out loud to all to hear. <coughs> the paper I have here shows the following. One, our late son Frank had 11 houses with one in America. Out of these, eight houses, including the one in America, will be inherited by his son, Chibuike, and his sister, Ada, while the remaining three will be for Linda and her only daughter. Two, our son Frank had five trailers and two 911 lorries. Out of these, four trailers and one 911 lorry will be inherited by his son, Chibuike, and his sister, Ada, while the remaining one trailer and one 911 lorry will be inherited by Linda and her daughter. Three, France Company and all his undeveloped landed property will be inherited by his son Chubike. This is because he happens to be the only male child in the family. However, Linda and her daughter will be earning 25% of the income from the company on monthly basis. Finally, our son Frank had about 352 million naira in the bank. Out of this, 25% will be given to Linda for the upbringing of her daughter, while the remaining one will be for Chibuike. That is all we have here. Thank you. Does anybody have anything to say? Any comments? I have something to say. My elders, I greet you all. I accept everything that has been read out in the will, except one thing. In Igbo tradition, it says that the family compound belongs to the son. And Chibuike is my son. Therefore, he, he inherits this compound. I cannot stay in this compound with Linda. She used to be my best friend. And if my best friend could do this to me, marry my own husband, then I am not safe. That is the only thing I have to say. Linda cannot stay in this compound. <clears throat> Um, our wife, we've heard what you said. Well, if uh, she must leave this compound for you, it then means that you have to make her comfortable. And that is to say that you have to build another house, maybe one of these uh, ones for her somewhere else, so that she can be comfortable. Okay, uh, Linda, have you heard what she said? Only on that condition, yes. 
So, what about the sharing of the property? Do you have anything to say? For now, no comment. I have something to say, my people. For Linda not to have listened to Ross and her husband, and to Toshi to court, we, the Umada, we had a meeting and concluded that Linda would not have anything to do with any of us. Yes. She will not come to the market to buy things where we buy. Bam. She will not come to our houses. Bam. And we will not go to hers. Yes. So. We have concluded that she will be on her own for three years. Fine. Now that is what we, the Umada, have concluded on. My people, did I talk well? Yes. I said arrant nonsense. Oh, wait. Am I supposed to be scared now? <laughs> I'm shaking with fear. Your banishment is, is the height of stupidity. Yes, yes because uh, I don't live in this miserable village of yours. I stay in United States of America. And I am not from this part of... Um, the world, I mean, your village. I'm not from here. So, how is your banishment supposed to have effect on me? Wake up. Think. Think. Come up. Please. If you don't mind. If you're done with your stupid, useless, senseless banishment. <laughs> Less door do you have? Ah, gentlemen, this is the thing that said I cannot rest in my husband's house. So please talk to her in a language she will understand. You can't stop me. Stop what? Mama! No! Now you? Not me smoking is bad for your health. Come here, it's your own. Come here! Yes! 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 What is that hand holding? Mama, come okay, and see what Linda is doing now. Yeah. Please, you have to look at her ugly face. So, I said, teach her the lesson I brought you here for. Mama, which mama? Mama, come and see what this is. <laughs> see what Linda is doing. Uncle, my head is out. Uncle, I'm glad it's here. You can't do me anything. Uncle, I'm glad it's here. Come and see what she's what doing. What's happening here? Leave me alone. Linda sent these dogs here to come and beat me up. Aro. Okute. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? My best. Linda. Imagine. You have caused more trouble than everybody in this city. What did I do, Papa? What did I do? Is it a time for me to marry? Linda, you're a devil. Against you are a devil. Yeah, 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 yeah. Linda, you're a devil. I am not a devil. You're a devil. Now, where do I look at it? You're a Papa. devil. Now, everyone, move. Move. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Move from She is the angel. Get up from here. Stop. Don't go anywhere. I'm going anywhere. I told you. 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 Where are you going? Go back. Where are you going? Where are you going? Come on, leave me alone. Leave me alone. I'll come back for you. Don't let me. Who fool? You and I'll be back for you. Come on, come on. 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 Come on, come on.
you. I said, you are dead. 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 You are You are dead. Now that your late husband Frank is dead, you're going with your mate Tochi, struggling for everything. Linda, why? Why don't you leave Tochi alone? The other day I heard you went and called talks for Tochi. Why don't you leave her alone? Really? Mm -hmm. I'm surprised at you, Mama. I'm shocked at you. Hmm? I should leave all these things for Tochi. Yes. Really? Okay. Let me ask you a question. What happens to my angel here when she grows up? Or when she grows up, I go with stories of that she used to have a father and that blah blah blah. One thing happened to, 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 to the father, the father died, the father's wife, I mean, could not allow her mother to stand her ground, and so she has no base. Is that what I'm going to tell her? Linda, does it matter? Does it matter, Linda? I am your mother. I'm not going to deceive you. Leave Tochi alone. You see why I did not support this marriage in the first instance? If the Omar does judge you, they will condemn you. If God judges you, Linda, God will condemn you. And if I, your mother, judge you, definitely I am going to condemn you. So leave Tochi alone. Are you afraid of Tochi? Linda. What is it in Tochi? Mama, oh, this is Linda. Hey, I will match her any day, any. In fact, she's even, she's less than me. Any day, any time, I will match her. Fire to fire, brimstone to brimstone. And you know that. So why are you scared? I am not scared. I am your mother. And I'm not going to deceive you. I don't want you to have any quarrels again with Tochi. Okay, no Please. problem. Please. I should leave it for God. Yes. I should leave it for Better. God. No problem, Mama. Anyway, um, I'll be inside the room, eh? Call God when he comes down. I'll come back. I'll come back here so we can judge the case, eh? I'll be waiting, Mama. Why I do support this marriage in the first instance? The very first day, I wasn't in support of this marriage. Now you know that's what is happening. We need to fight Tochi. Calling thoughts. Linda, this issue we have been over it a number of times. This is an issue that has generated a lot of emotions. Tempers have been raised. The scripture says that it is an honor for a person to cease from strife. It goes on to say that a wrathful person makes haste to cause strife. But one that is slow to anger sees it from strife and make it peace. After all that has happened, Linda, I strongly expect that we should be on the path to making amends and making peace with God. Linda, I must advise. Listen to my words. Frank. Why did you do this to me, Frank? I loved you and trusted you. You were so loving and kind. Why did it have to be Linda? My own friend. Somebody that was closer to me than a sister. You could have picked any other woman in the world. What am I going to do now, Frank? What am I going to do without you? You are so loving, so kind, so caring, so trustworthy. 
What happened? How am I ever supposed to take back the pieces of my life? It's bad enough you are dead. Look at the burden I have left on me. Why did you do this to me? I don't know what to do now. I don't know what to do. I know you're a man. And you're bound to make mistakes. So I'll forgive you, my love. But you have to help me. I don't know what to do without you. And you are my husband. And the father of my children. So I have no choice but to forgive. I don't know what to do now without you, Frank. This is so painful. To me, after all, we've been through. And that's what friends are for. I don't need friends anymore. <laughs> <laughs> talking about right from our GS1 days through to our university and yet we've still managed to remain good friends in fact best friends that's not very easy you know that right yeah I know so I feel that all I have to tell you is the truth at all times this your fighting with girls over their fiancés is very very wrong I mean it just has to stop what happened to you? Had a fight. Another one? Not again. And who's the girl this time? Tamara. She met me at John's place. Amara? Mm -hmm. But weren't you the one that told me that they were dating? What were you doing there? John told me he was done with Amara. He invited me over, so I, I went visiting. And you stupidly believed him. God, you see why I've told you I don't want to have anything to do with any of these men? Look at you. You were the one telling me that I should date Frank. How do you think I would feel if I went to Frank's house and I saw another woman there? How? Touchy, please. Honestly, eh, what I need now is a dad and not a son, okay? Please. So if you can just help me dab my face, thank you. Of course I will help. But you really have to be careful. <laughs> These girls will destroy you one day. They'll kill you. Tochi! Easy now, this thing hurts.
reaching my daughter. Yes, ma'am. Since your husband, my son is dead, and you are giving his company to control, please make sure you prove to the people out there that you are a wise and hardworking lady. Please, don't fail me. Mama, Mama, it's okay. I love Frank very much. And I will make sure that I hold that responsibility to the best of my ability. I know you think I've come to make trouble again. I've not. Tochi, you're my best friend. But I betrayed our friendship. I've come to tell you. How sorry I am. And to ask for your forgiveness. And yesterday I saw you. But you didn't see me. You were talking and crying at Frank's great sight. It broke my heart. And it showed me what a miserable scheme I have been. For the first time in my adult life, tears came to my eyes. I fled to my room to ponder over things and suffer in my conscience. night has images of our friendship and how deep I betrayed you haunted me. Please touch you. Take my daughter Angel. Raise her up as your own. I want nothing else from this family. Not the cars. Not the money. Not the property. They are rightfully yours, Torchy. Please. Do not punish Angel for the sins I've committed against you. Please. Come, Angel. Goodbye, Angel. What's your mother?
goodbye, Mama. Frank has left us with an enormous responsibility to manage his vast business empire. And you're still my best friend. I can't do it alone. I need you. I need you to help me. Linda. Even help us forgives the repentant sinner. We have forgiven you. I will speak to the elders and no matter on your behalf. I am not your best friend. I betrayed you. Why are you condemning yourself like this? I'm not condemning you anymore. I know you'll be wondering how I could ever forgive you. But I've loved you ever since the day we met while we were spinsters. Please, Linda. I'm ready to share everything that Frank has equally with you. Please, don't go like this. Please take care of my daughter. I must go away. I must go to find my luck in the world. And leave you to mourn your dear husband in peace. It cost you too much pain, don't you? I'm no longer ready to be called your friend. No. Oh, God. I'm sorry. Afro TV, enjoy various genres of entertainment programming from the comfort of your home through our satellite delivered channels in your favorite languages French, English, Swahili, Sri, Igbo, Hausa, Yoruba, and so on. Afro Dubbing Services. With the largest number of dubbing studios in Africa, we can help you dub your videos to major languages in Africa Swahili, English, French, Yoruba, Hausa, Igbo, Wolof, Zulu, and so on. Aforevo YouTube, the largest YouTube partner in Africa, with over 500 channels of top African entertainment and millions of eyeballs daily, we help thousands of video creators make money on YouTube. Aforevo, the revolution is on.